Welcome back, everybody, to another Poetry Hour. I know, I know, it's been a while since you guys heard me, and I'm sorry for that. I've had a lot going on, and I'm not sure if I put... I, I know it's been a while, I just don't remember how long, but I do know I have quite a bit of stuff to show you, so it's not like I came on here for no reason. <laughs> And I miss you guys, first of all. And I appreciate everyone who's been listening to me when I haven't been on. I really appreciate that. It means a lot. I'm almost at 3,000 listeners with all my shows all together. But I appreciate it once more. You will get quite a bit from me tonight. But this one, I'm going to do maybe four, five poems tonight. Because, I, like I said, I've been working on a lot. It's been a lot pumping out. And then, also, I want to let you guys know to whatever you're listening to me from. I also have other things. Like, I have a Twitter, which is PoetSoul25. I have a, I, I have an Instagram, which is PoetSoul30. I have... If you guys are listening to me from YouTube, please subscribe. I always welcome subscribers. I re- really love it. Thank you. Um, let's see. I have a Patreon. If I'm right, that is Poet Soul 30, but I am not sure if I will try to link it later. Because how I do it, it shares out to everybody. So these podcasts, sometimes I don't get to link everything right away. And I just want to say, once again, I miss you guys. And thank you for listening to me when I wasn't on here. It's encouraging to know that people were still listening and people still want to hear my poems and everything else. And with that, I'm going to keep playing the song, which, by the way, I should have told you that first. The song you guys were listening to is We Fell in Love in the Dark. So I hope you guys enjoy that. I'm going to play it a few more minutes and then we can get this cracking. Okay, and I'm back. I think the first set of poems I'm going to do tonight will be from my phone. I have some that's... Let's see how I can explain this easy. I write on anything I can. I write on my phone. I have notebooks I write on. So yes, when I say I'm, I gotta go from different things, I go from different things. So, let me get onto the screen I need real quick and we can start this. All right, so the first poem is Nighttime Thoughts. It's a short but sweet one. Nighttime Thoughts. So another sleepless night. What's keeping you up tonight? Maybe it's because you're missing the one who has your heart. Or maybe it could be that you're ready to be with that person. Maybe it's because you've learned or you know now that you can't sleep without that person at night. But then again, maybe it's because there's something on your mind, on your heart. And that was Nighttime Thoughts. That poem, it was a sleepless night and... I was having nightmares because I've been dealing with a lot this year and I got inspired 
like I've said before, my life inspires my poetry. So, with that, I'm going to play the same song I was playing earlier, again. And let me get prepared for the next poem. Right, and I'm back. So the next one I'm doing is called Bear to You. You might have seen this on my social medias if you have, you know, social media, but now I'm actually reading it. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Bear to You. I want to be I want to bear myself to you, not just physically, but emotionally and mentally. I want you to see my scars that I hide from the world. And explain how I got them. I hope you're understanding and not judgmental. Well, let's see what happens. That was once again bare to you. I'm not sure how many of these ones that I've done before. Because I know I was working on some before I went on my break. But I do have, they're called like short sentence, short sentence stories or short sentence poems. I have a couple of them I've been doing and I hope you guys enjoy. I'm not sure where or which one I'm going to do, but I'm going to do one. So this one is, some days I wonder... How much can someone take before they can't anymore? That is one of them I did. Here's another one. This one's a little bit longer. This is two sentences, but still it's short. With a shocked look, he asked why. Why would you do this? She said, what? You can't deal with the monster you created? That is another one. And the other one I have is, and one day she will realize how true love really feels. I'm not sure exactly where I got this concept of the short stories, the short, the sentence story poems from, but I enjoy it. Cause like sometimes you could tell a whole story in just one sentence. Let's see. I'm going to give you guys another break from hearing me. Finish this song out. Well, you can't completely finish the song. It's kind of long, but have it on here for a few more minutes. And then I'll do one more poem before I hit the road.
All right, and I am back for one more. And this poem is untitled because I... This is one I did on a whim. And this might go part of a series having to do with journeys in life. So this one is still untitled. So I hope you guys enjoy this untitled poem. I feel like it's it's a reason why we have some why we meet some people in life. Some people are meant to be in your life for a lifetime. And some people are meant to only help you get through your journey, no matter how long or how short it is. Because some people are only seasonal. Meanwhile, sometimes some people are lifetime people. But don't let the seasonals confuse you with the lifetimes. And with that, I just want to say I feel so happy to be back. And I appreciate you guys listening to me when I wasn't on here, listening to the old podcasts, listening to any of the shows. I really appreciate you guys listening to me. If follow me on my social medias, which I hopefully can link them down. And with that, I hope you guys enjoyed everything. And it feels good to be back. <laughs>